This year's Sundance Film Festival comes at a moment of cultural change. One of the main topics of discussion, the fallout from the Harvey Weinstein sexual misconduct scandal, the rise of the Me Too movement, and the demands for more representation by women in the film industry. It's kind of a tipping point because it's changing the order of things so that women are gonna have a stronger voice. And I think the role for women to be able to step forward and, and exercise their voices more and more, I think is a really wonderful thing. And I think the role for men right now would be to listen. About one third of the nearly 200 films presented here this year are by women directors, including Holiday, a film shot in Turkey whose Swedish director says women everywhere are fed up with keeping secrets. As an artist, I hate censorship in, of any kind, and it was a kind of censorship. Like, no, that's too private, that's too icky, that's too weird, we don't want to know. The film's lead actress, Victoria Sonne, is part of the Me Too movement. I experience right now that there's a lot of uh, females who are really taking this very seriously. Documentaries on view here at the festival include biographies of women who fought for their rights and an unflinching look at gender disparities in the film industry. RBG is a biopic of pioneering female lawyer and U.S. Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg. I'm so proud of all of the women who have had the courage to speak out. Seeing Allred is a portrait of the powerful women's rights attorney Gloria Allred. Festival strategist and publicist Kathleen McInnes is an advocate for female film industry professionals. We have celebrity. That's the thing that we have that's different than the other industries. I think a lot of the hospitality industry, I think of the service industry, they are invisible almost to a lot of people. We don't have invisibility, we have celebrity which has a lot of visibility. Visibility and now more power to accomplish change. Rob Reynolds, Al Jazeera, Park City, Utah.